Good afternoon. Now it's afternoon here and uh, welcome to Tech Talk again. Today we are discussing uh, the issue of OTT, the OTT platforms which the government has suddenly woken up and uh, issued a gazette notification signed by the president saying that the government wants to bring in OTT platforms under its, uh, its ambit. So far it is not under the government's ambit no restrictions anybody can uh, you know host an ott platform and put whatever is the content which is um, which they like i have with me anil nair who is uh, uh, an ott platform provider and he is running a very important ott platform called sabha tv for kerala uh, legislative assembly which has not only the uh, the proceedings of the assembly but it it gives an overview about the entire working of the assembly and also uh, about the senior politicians the important landmarks and all such things very informative channel which uh, he and his friends and this his company has able to hoist so i will ask anil of his experience with uh, ott platforms and how the reason more the government is going to uh, affect it or going to popularize it or going to going to control it anil let's start with uh, uh, you know uh, how did this ott platform become an issue in india because that's what the government suddenly woke up that there is a issue there and you need to control it you need to have uh, you know regulations around it uh, one fine day ott is becoming an issue in india but it is really surprising that why it is becoming an issue uh, because we have to say a lot of conspiracy theories <laughs> about this yeah. because uh, of course uh, 2010 onwards ott is popular in india especially netflix came after that uh, netflix is a worldwide provider in india uh, india ditto tv came ditto tv Okay. from z z network hmm. then yap tv from andhra these are the two ott platforms in that time then some other providers also even my company had, uh, released the first ott platform in kerala in 2012 okay we can say that is uh, too early for that technology okay but well, how how does that, it work can you because it's, everybody talks about ott how does it work what is is it? It's an OTT over the top platform. Means it's all the here, top. Part. Here, the thing is, everybody is telling OTT. See, OTT simply we can say over the top. Facebook is an OTT platform. YouTube is an OTT platform. Twitter is an OTT platform. Even Uber is an OTT platform. Okay. Or Zomato is an OTT platform. Okay. Everything run on OTT. In maybe we can say that web. Websites, earlier websites, we can say maybe we are not seeing that it is an OTT, but now a lot of websites also, even that you uh, using the just text based or text and images based websites also using the OTT technology because when it is coming to the three tier architecture, in becoming to the microservice architecture or in the other complicated architectures, we can say that it is over the top. Okay, over but, the top of what? That question comes in, you know, over the top. Over the top of the, over the, top of the internet. Internet, okay. okay. Yeah. yeah, so that is the reason I told uh, Uber also an OTT platform. Okay, but, but, but uh, uh, Anil, Anil uh, one uh, sub, uh, you know, question around it is that uh, most of these OTT platforms in India become popular through the smartphones. Why is it so? Yeah, even Uber also, in that case, Uber and Ola also in the part. Uber and o Ola also uh, using mobiles. He, yeah. Here, we have, to spe we have to specifically say that video streaming OTT platforms. That is okay. the right name, actually. Okay. Because okay. this is the video streaming OTT platforms. Netflix, okay. Prime, Z, mm -hmm. Alt, Alt, Balaji, mm -hmm. N number of other brands or products those are video streaming ott platforms whether it's a live or vod okay 
so so the issue issue with the government fines is on the video streaming ott platforms is it is it right exactly exactly that i'm i'm also uh, with my understanding that is the problem the the, the, the first hand report uh, we can say fir yeah. <laughs> what's the information report yeah. saying that these platforms are showing lot of uh, porn contents that is the first comment uh, uh, coming from lot of people are saying that the the, the, the supporters okay and now now in india because you are the best at analytics for politics other than me better than me yeah. because in the central government if say something a majority of people are blindly supporting it blindly oppositing it so okay. here the, the 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 supporters are saying that because of this okay uh, and in now days in india even oppositions are uh, we are losing our voice actually i don't know whether it is right or wrong but i feel like that okay okay <laughs> so 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 how do you how do you think this has come up which means uh, you know we all know about uh, government of india trying to control porn through blocking websites so you mean yeah. to say government of india cannot do it on uh, you know on ott platforms and how did this uh, happen because you know uh, uh, i i can i can understand balaji you know balaji films and all getting into ott platforms to maximize their revenue but this is something totally new which happened i am told from bombay calcutta and all a huge number of uh, porn videos indian porn videos are uploaded and it's getting immensely popular we cannot call them porn videos we can say that uh, x rated videos like uh, x or double x these platforms are not showing triple x kind of uh, triple x kind of uh, contents okay they are in in the in that category maybe it is 18 plus even if they are going to censor the movie censor but also allow those kind of contents mm -hmm. frankly speaking because i watch it because i am into the in industry i am and uh, i am watching all the contents all the materials how they are providing content the quality of content the, mm -hmm. even the technical quality other quality uh, mm -hmm. so here uh, that is i'm i'm not feeling that that is a real reason or okay. government is saying that in future this platform will show uh, in the in the future the, this platform will show triple x content that is the reason we are stopping now okay. i think is it is it uh, is it uh, sensible in malayalam we are saying that avada vella ulladun ivudne mundu vadakundallo okay so we have water somewhere and why why you have to take precaution here okay fine yeah. uh, but uh, how has anybody done a survey of this ott content platforms in india video content especially uh, what's your information about it and what's the size of it how many of you know see here the contents uh, i believe the popular in, in the ott contents nearly 20 platforms is there less than 20 popular platforms Okay. i mean popular means uh, uh, 100000 plus downloads okay that is we can say reasonable size below that maybe we, we can say 100 100 uh, platform okay that is everybody trying to get a uh, get a piece of pie mm. when the uh, it, uh, so it, it's an opportunity everybody trying their luck Okay, uh, how what is their business model like? You said that uh, some of them have a subscription, like maybe three hundred rupees a month, and they upload yeah. three four films. You know, is that the model or what's the model like business model? You see here, uh, the, uh, for the uh, for the monetizing part, the, the first thing is ad based. So this porn content they cannot do. Only the news based or that kind of content people can only. Uh, take the revenue through the ad based the revenue model they will mm. do some advertisement and is a compared to the broadcasting and the streaming uh, uh, this streaming platforms can sell their product into the uh, pinpoint accuracy they are selling their uh, advertisement in the eyeballs mm. so customer also uh, agree to do that because the, the, they have guarantee that their ad is viewed x number of people Okay. so x number of viewer x number of eyeball into yes maybe currently the market pace is 15 to 20 paisa per eyeball okay, okay. So that is a that is a mechanism okay. but in the end of this uh, other in the other part like uh, 
uh, Art Balaji or Lulu, Kuku, all these uh, platforms, they are doing some kind of subscription model. And those platforms are the most profitable platforms. Even uh, Netflix and Amazon is not making money. These people are making money mm -hmm. because people are don't mind to send uh, $5, $6 or equivalent to Indian rupees, subscribe those contents. Uh, you know, so also, uh, whom do you think has the largest market share in this in this uh, subscription model ones? Who's the leader? Subscription. See, of course, yeah, Netflix and Amazon because of some X Y Z reason. If you can compare the Indian scenario, yeah. as per my understanding, Art Balaji. Art Balaji. Okay. Yeah. What's yeah. the subscription base? Subscription base. They have around uh, nearly ten million, I believe. I don't know the exact number, but it is okay. more than 10 million. Okay, 10 million into, let's say 10 million, one crore into uh, 300 rupees. It's huge, you know, it is about 300 crores a month, you know, so it's uh, not a, yeah. it's a good business model, you know, whatever they're doing. <laughs> okay, yeah. but see, here I know there's a platform called the Cuckoo. Yeah. Those platform, I think, I believe it is, uh, it is uh, pronouncing Cuckoo. Yeah. They have 5 million plus downloads. Okay. Recently started within six months. Okay. Recently started a platform, a uh, five million subscription base. Uh, they are charging three hundred rupees. Okay. Just imagine how much money they are making. Yeah, and, that's uh, a, that's a, that's the whole thing. That's a, that that that's that's like one fifty you know uh, cross and month. Yeah. That's a huge thing. And you run this Sabah TV for Kerala Assembly. What is the experience like? How is it going? And uh, what all it takes to make such a OTT platform? Sabha TV is an initiative from our honorable speaker, uh, 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 Sri P. Sri Ramakrishnan. That is his initiative. And he decided to start an, uh, start an OTT platform because OTT is the future. And uh, see, all these platforms are showing content with their interests. But there is a lot of other content having the uh, uh, other value, education value, history okay. value. Okay. So for, for an example, uh, every day our, in all sections, sub sections, there is a new, new bill is coming. Okay. For an a, a example, wetland uh, bill or land remotion bill, a lot of bill is coming. So what is the reason, what is the history, what is the requirement? All these things are explaining in this kind of, uh, they're documenting all those things. And people like to know, or all people can know how it is happened, what is the procedure. Hmm. Because it's a, it's a democratic world, you know. In hmm. India, it's a democratic country, and uh, assembly is the place for the people. To discuss and, uh, all those things, yes. Yeah, yes. so it, that is a have, even it is a, uh, even assembly is for the public, but whatever happening, it's in the close close uh, room and close uh, circle. So those activities people can watch live, what is happening uh, in, in the Sabha, Sabha floor. Mm. The same time now, uh, uh, now uh, uh, Sabha is, is decided to archive last, uh, uh, now we have, uh, uh, this is the 14th assembly. Mm. So all uh, past 70 years of uh, assembly history, they are going to archive it. So uh, who have the, uh, students or other guys who will have the interest about the technology or sorry interest about uh, the history or the whatever happened it, it is there in the archive so people can access and wa watch it yeah uh, that, uh, that, that comes to the next question okay fine you have a platform uh, you know you don't see this being advertised other than Netflix and few others in the conventional media so how do, how does it reach people? Like for instance, you said about Cuckoo. I came to know about Cuckoo recently because somebody forwarded something to me. Then I got interested and you know opened it, and I was really su surprised at what the hell is happening. We don't know what's happening in that world, but suddenly you are faced with such a this thing. So how does that work? You know, because even Sabha TV, uh, I am told it works on the downloads. So how do you get to people? Social media. Okay. Okay. Yeah, simple, very simple. Social media is the best tool, okay. and that is the uh, that, uh, that is the, uh, the the fear also came because of that the power of social media. Okay. Government. Uh, yeah. 
uh, if uh, kind of kindly correct me if i am wrong yeah. the government used to the social media to become the become to the power mm. and the same now the same government is trying to control the social media yeah yeah am I right? yeah because it's it it works both ways you know so yeah, yeah. It cuts both ways yeah so yeah. so that's it but um in terms of reach uh, in india okay you have you have let's say out of 100 and uh, 101 15 or 120 phone connections i'm told about uh, uh, 60% have smartphones so yeah can you say can you reasonably assume that this 60% which is over and above all the reach of all the all the conventional media that these uh, these apps and ott platforms can reach what could be the reach yeah, <clears throat> see here the in the ott business language is uh, one important thing is when you develop the technology yeah, even i uh, even a ott platform from kerala suppose saina video they are coming with the, their platform called the saina play you say saina is a malayalam dvd player into the movie industry they are into this dvd business now they are coming to the ott business hmm. but they are targeting malayalam content but their platform can cater any language because there is no language barrier they they can publish content mm-hmm. so this kind of platforms whoever targeting the global perspective mm-hmm. they have a better reach then they are using social media to re- reach the platform but one thing is there if you i hope you are noticed last year 2018 uh, 19 uh, prime and netflix made a lot of flex in the town no when they are releasing a movie they put lot yeah. of flexes yeah they covered uh, flexes in mumbai city and other cities hmm. It, but that is for a bigger investment but kuku lulu kind of uh, people they are not done any flex there still they yeah. are they are able to survive hmm. so if you, if you are building a business model with if you you you, you, you can achieve minimum 100000 subscribers hmm. with a 5 dollar subscription hmm. you can survive okay okay for so, an example so you see see you since you have a let's say some tv platform so you, the content is not yours you just give the technical platform to 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 host the content is it not yes yes for sabha tv we are just we are a technology provider just we are we provide the platform to sabha that's okay. all okay but in I, the, the same time we have because of this current scenario we have a, another business model we are coming with a, another concept called run the platform you can run an ott platform from us hmm. you just pay the rent hmm. forget about the technology forget about the huge investment to develop the technology just focus on your content okay uh, I, i i i like to tell you an interesting story from west bengal calcutta there is okay. a platform called bengala fast okay they have only uh, nearly 10000 subscribers okay and they are charging this 5 dollar mm-hmm. and they are putting content they are making content and putting short films they are making small small short, they are making short films and uh, bengali short films and they are putting that platform okay nearly they have now they are less than 100 content only they have mm. every month they are putting two short films mm. they are able to uh, just imagine that they are able to survive okay okay they are making content every month okay so so so, so let's say you know your platform you have the capability so any anybody can put a content for some time like let's say somebody wants to run a campaign on some issues you can they can put it on your platform and be happy for that no, period not not exactly like that we are providing the platform in your brand name hmm. the platform is your platform your domain address hmm. that is your product your platform we are providing the technology only okay we can say that it is white labeling on a okay. rental basis you don't need to pay big money okay to develop it, it is, again yeah we already developed it and it we are white labeling for you this is you, you your product your brand you, and your content all access is 
viewers we are just charging a small money for the technology and it support okay okay so uh, then comes to this effort of the government you know this government notification has uh, you know made uh, many people respond like i uh, foundation it uh, former asian and chief uh, shashi kumar criticizing it saying that it's a censorship it amounts to censorship it amounts to you know cutting uh, freedom of expression everything so uh, of course uh, you know he has taken he has taken it in the normal media business uh, style but when you when you when it comes to what you said about you know all these things happening like cuckoos and bengla films and x films and double x films how do you think the process can go on will the government be able to control the, these people uh, actually because i am told they keep changing their you know domain names and be their kind of thing uh, no no uh, see here uh, again i like to say an example from malayalam uh, there is a phrase in malayalam called kottail vellam koru mm -hmm. okay uh, yeah you, this you, yeah you, you know in a, you know uh, yeah. water into the basket yes because the government is doing exactly that because okay. they cannot control that mm -hmm. see uh, i you started a channel in youtube yeah you started this channel as per the youtube policy yes if you can follow the youtube policy you can start a channel mm -hmm. that means you so youtube itself having some kind of regulations mm -hmm. restrictions guidelines am i right Yes, yes youtube is officially working in india in the government is approved to run business in india okay youtube is an ott platform you are started a uh, channel there mm. so if government is saying that you need additional license to start a platform in youtube that mm. means you are in india you are giving more restrictions to google to operate in india the uh, youtube yeah of course of course yeah so it's a it's, it's a kind of double whammy kind of thing pardon it's a kind of double whammy that there is already a restriction you are again telling that whatever the content we need to do it separately is that yeah it is not it, yeah it is not possible actually how you are going, okay this is you, 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 your channel in youtube government is saying that these are the conditions to start a channel in youtube fine what about in facebook in your facebook page if you are putting a comment there yes again government is going to control that yes yeah. so charyan You, yeah, this yeah. kind of comments is not allowed yeah that, exactly. which means that about 40 crore people have to register and i don't think government yeah. even can handle it no so yeah, yeah. Got, got, and uh, yeah, there is a one thing and second thing i started a website hmm. if the domain is that example dot in government can control yes if it is my domain is example dot com or example dot xyz how yeah. kerala uh, indian government have access there is no access in india government i am not putting the server in india okay okay yeah oh okay you anil you are an indian citizen you this is your number so you cannot do okay i am not doing someone else is doing then yes. how, how you can control that yes yes so it's like a tom and jerry kind of situation you know the the chase continues but it comes yeah, that, and uh, see i like to uh, i like to point uh, i like to uh, uh, one more point is there in 2014 hmm. richard d james he released his album in deep web you can see this article in guardian it's uh, on monday 18th august 2014 uh, in the you can see if you search you can see that okay sayro s y r o okay that album they released in deep web hmm. so uh, we are into that that generation okay in a, a dotonian you, you in the in the tor browsing <laughs> there is no way to control okay so if government is putting more restriction and if i am going to the i am putting a i am putting a server somewhere and if i am sending a tor link to you or xyz because earlier you asked how it is uh, reaching the people patayathil nella undengil eli vayanattil nu varu there is a demand yeah it will yeah it will happen from anywhere okay <laughs> so so yeah. uh, so next day government is 
wake up and say that oh we are going to control uh, deep do you think that it is possible yes yes it's like controlling the porn on the net because all the friends experts say that porn actually push the internet itself you know social media everything the dating sites and porn and all of them were like uh, you know they are the initial pull 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 for the internet the use of this and then you know it, it went down to the this it, it went down to few interested parties you know so one more thing is there yeah suppose 10 members they are going to uh, decide the policy of this thing okay just imagine the 10 people yeah out of 10 maybe one or two is enjoying this 100% in the public they have a different space yeah. where the, the same person who is making the policy when yeah. coming to the home he is also going to surfing and enjoying this yes it's a human nature some of the things better don't control it mm. i know I or know. better to give a space for that yeah. that is yeah. uh, i think in a way uh, indirectly government is giving publicity to all these things you know because nobody knew Other very person. few people know oh, this is happening and now everybody yeah, yeah, yeah. become curious you know something is happening in that platform yeah, so we yeah. must go there and you know watch it or try to find out what it is so like i never knew this is a serious thing but when when i heard it and when this order came i knew it is a serious issue so then i am talking to you to find out how is it going what is the business model whether it it can be controlled or not you know it's, i think it's a it works both ways you know so the control uh, Uh, one more thing is there here it is controlled actually there is some kind of chat like a chat platform is there yeah chat platform huh. and it it is uh, those platforms are uh, banned in india but uh, through the other onion routing you can go there hmm. yeah uh, this uh, uh, philippines is the uh, hub of that actually so you pay some money the, the, those people will do the on whatever activities you need okay and uh, some of the platform some say, like exactly like tiktok oh so okay. those guys will do some kind of uh, presentation shows private shows and maybe thousands are watching same time i'm paying just 1 dollar or <laughs> 1 cent or something it's a business actually it's an industry if you just yeah using this uh, this thing yeah this that's like, yeah possibly. that's an interesting uh, thing which uh, Uh, the technology is getting into the social space and how the governments and others trying to control it thank you anil for this uh, you know enlightening uh, talk and we'll keep it up and um, all the best for your platforms thank you thank you thank you